Out of the eight pottery workshops in the valley, all the potters, with one exception, are members of a single clan, or Hamula, and have the same last name, Al Fakuri, which means potter. Pottery making is traditionally a male occupation, with the techniques and crafts being handed down from father to son. The workshop is run by Abu Wahid, who, unlike his sons, has no specific job in the pottery. He supervises over the workshop, helping out where needed, and makes sure that production runs smoothly. Each son has specific responsibilities within the workshop. These are delegated in degrees of importance from the oldest to the youngest. The two oldest sons work at the wheels, which are sunk into pits in the floor. This innovation lowers the potters and allows the floor surrounding them to be used for stacking freshly thrown pots. The younger brothers keep the potters supplied with fresh materials and remove vessels as they are thrown. Two types of clay are collected locally and brought to the workshops. A red clay, samaka, which is high in iron, and a white clay, kalala, which has a low mineral content. Each clay has its own unique properties, but when mixed together, these two clays make a good, even textured material suitable for the particular needs of these potters.